Candy is the highlight of Halloween for many, but this year there could be a noticeable difference involving chocolate prices, portion size, taste, and even availability in Hawaii. Our Eric Nackton reports on the cacao challenges this year. It has been kind of challenging, especially when it comes to trying to buy those little fun size candies. Sometimes I don't really find the ones I need. It doesn't taste how it should. I think that this cacao challenge that we're having is definitely hitting home. Halloween is often spooky, and this year local candy quality and pricing could be contributing factors. Cacao prices have more than doubled since the start of the year and have remained at record highs. That's according to Wells Fargo data shared with CNN. Many experts feel it's not a normal agricultural crop that grows everywhere like other commodities. It's believed over the past few years, adverse weather events have severely impacted cacao producing regions of the world, including West Africa. Manoa Chocolate in Kailua is well aware of recent difficulties. So these are a bunch of different chocolate treats that we make for our store. We in Manoa have our own chocolate farm right now so we have Kamana Nui and so that's something that we have a hundred acres and we always source out of Oahu Big Island for our chocolate. This is a cacao pod so this is what is made from this is what makes chocolate from these little beans here we roast them and then they come into cacao nibs that we crush up until it is the right consistency. If we don't have the fruit if they don't get pollinated um, if they don't have the right um, right weather, then the, the chocolate will be greatly, uh, the, the pods won't be produced and we won't have enough chocolate. These are only grown in the Hawaiian Island chains because we are on a chocolate belt, which means you have to be either 21 degrees north or south of the equator. Whether it's high end, 95% cacao chocolate, or whether it be a Nestle Crunch, anything, 100 grand, Whatever you like, M&M's, prices could be on the rise. Correct. So I think that their percentage, I think it's all going to be the same chocolate. The prices are going to skyrocket and you might not have as much quantity on the shelf. I don't think the quality of any of that chocolate is going to change. It's going to be more... Um, hard to find and hard to um, hard to get to on shelf so you'll see in in whatever store that those products will go fast when it comes to countless local companies including Manoa chocolate support of local farmers remains among the utmost importance while the challenges may have increased the standards remain the same and we make sure we use our water and resources to create um, cacao that everyone wants to buy so we're creating quality products we are supporting local farmers in the work that we do it's very important important that uh, we are getting locally sourced cacao beans. We couldn't do it without them. They are literally growing the product that we use. In Kailua, Eric Nacton, Island News.